The first U.S. church official to be convicted for covering up sex abuse claims against priests has been sentenced. Monsignor William Lynn will spend the next three to six years in prison. Lynn was the former secretary for clergy for the Archdiocese of Philadelphia. From 1992 to 2004, he handled priest assignments and child sexual assault complaints. But he's accused of transferring problem priests in one of the country's largest parishes and keeping complaints out of the public eye. He locked away in a vault the names of pedophile priests. He locked in a vault the names of men that he knew had abused children. He now would be locked away for a fraction of the time he kept that secret vault. Last month, a jury convicted Lynn of felony child endangerment for his oversight of a now defrocked priest. Lynn's lawyers sought probation, arguing their client shouldn't serve more time than the abusers. All of a sudden, he's, he's being held responsible for all of the abuse that occurred over, over 30 to 40 years, none of which he participated. And the priest that he did investigate, believe me, never abused again. So, you know, yeah, I think the sentence was grossly imbalanced. The attorneys avowed an appeal of the landmark conviction. Matt Friedman. Associated Press.